Hey guys, hope you're having an awesome day so far. Real quick, I'm going to be going over a guide on how to uh, pickpocket and gain thieving XP from Monkey Knife Fighters. Now the requirements for this are 70 thieving and you need to have completed the Do No Evil quest. In my opinion, it's a very good way to get your thieving level up if you can't yet pickpocket elves in Cryptinus. So something to definitely look into getting the requirements for if you don't have them already. So I'm just going to go through the fairy ring in order to get to Apatol. Um, that's actually the reason I brought my Ninja Monkey Grigri, because I need it to get through the rest of the agility course. Now, if you want to travel to Apatol through some Apatol teleport or going through from the, uh, the Grand Tree and all of that, then feel free to do that. This is just my personal way I like to get to Apatol. So I always have to bring this Grigri with me when I go there. You can see the gear I'm using. I've got Exoskeleton, I have the, Ar uh, the Ardune Cloak, I have Black Ibis Boots, and I have the Ring of Wealth. I, I think the Ring of Wealth helps with pickpocketing. Again, this isn't something I'm like 100% sure on. Of course, there isn't any other ring slot item that would be more beneficial, so I, in all, in all honesty, just bring it just in case it helps. It can't hurt. Um, if you haven't yet completed the Plague's Edge quest and you don't have access to the exoskeleton suit, which, by the way, is very, very helpful for thieving in multiple ways, I highly recommend getting that. But if you don't have that yet, other alternatives could be things like the Agile Top and Legs. These reduce your weight, and I believe that that helps a lot with pickpocketing and thieving in general. I can't really think of anything else that would be very useful. I also have Gloves of Silence as another good option if you want to use that. But this is basically what you have to do. You need to have a Gorilla Monkey Grigri so that you can be a gorilla and you can knock out the Monkey Knife Fighters. Now, I haven't done this in a while, so I'm sorry if my clicks are a little bit off. But basically what you need to do is you punch them, you pickpocket them, and you pickpocket them again. See, I'm getting loot. I know I'm not getting XP because I'm 200 mil thieving, but I did pickpocket them twice. And if we watch the loot closely, you can see that I actually do get two times worth of loot. And if you time your clicks right, the monkey actually never gets up. You need to do two pickpockets for each time you punch the monkey to get the maximum XP per hour. Doing this, you can get well over 300k XP per hour. I don't remember specifically what uh, the RS wiki says about it, but I know it's up there. It's around 300, maybe 350, but I, I wouldn't bet too much on that. And again, you can get stunned and everything from this. Just uh, typically when you're trying to punch the monkey, they'll, they'll catch you beforehand, so that can be kind of frustrating. But other than that, it's a great way of training thieving. I hope this guide has helped you. Um, with you know general requirements, things you need, and how to maximize your monkey knife fighter pickpocketing XP per hour. Hope you have a fantastic day. Check out my channel. Look for other videos I have. I've got a whole bunch of ideas for new videos, so please subscribe and like the video if you enjoyed it. Support the content. Hope you have an awesome day. Stay happy.